the hot dog. Many Chicagoans consider them to be a work of art. No ketchup, of course. But <laughs> one Chicago woman is elevating them from the paper wrapper or maybe the plastic basket to the artist's canvas. CBS 2's Noel Brennan shares her recipe for success. I use some neon colors. You can kind of like see on my palette here. We all like our art a certain way. Edward Hopper-esque? Yeah. But an artist like Julia Hagen agrees. Yeah, this is the first year of the hot dog, though. This There's only one really way said, like, to order a hot dog. Fully Chicago style. I'm not a big tomato person, so I will pick the tomatoes off. From her home studio. Where I exist. <laughs> Julia serves people who have a palette for Chicago style paintings. The mission is to visit, is to visit and then paint as many Chicago hot dog stands as I can in 2024. I'm not painting the actual hot dog, you know, I'm painting the the place, maybe the experience of like going there. So I think it's sort of like storytelling through hot dog stands. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the mission started in Logan Square with Red Hot Ranch and a realization. Even a humble hot dog stand can be fine art. I've only done nine so far, so this is kind of wild to me. I just didn't realize they meant this much to people. Julia visits each stand, samples each hot dog, and spends a week on each piece. So I'm currently working on Jimmy's, orig original Jimmy's. She documents um, the process on Instagram. My name is Julia Hagen. And I'm relishes customer and feedback. People have been mad at me. They're like, we told you to paint Jimmy's. Like, why haven't you painted Jimmy's yet? So I was like, all right, the people have spoken. I have to go. Paint Jimmy's. By year's end, Julia hopes to finish more than 50 canvas paintings. People are like really excited when they grab the original from my website. So every last stand painted to order, Chicago style. 2024, it's gonna be the year of the hot dog. We're gonna go to as many as we can. Noel Brennan, CBS 2 News.